Yo, what's good, fans of Fight Fans? It's your boy JB Trap House Boston. I'm back again with another post fight reaction. Okay, now this is Lewis Neri versus Jason uh, Kanoe. And, uh, you know, it didn't last long. Uh, I believe it lasted in, was it the, the second, second round? And basically, if y'all don't know uh, Lewis, Lewis Neri, he's been on a uh, suspension for. You know, he got caught with a, a banned substance. Alleged, you know, well, not allegedly, that's the truth. So uh, he's been on the layoff, and uh, he kind of put his put his career on the a, on a back burner. But uh, he knocks out Jason Kanoe, and uh, actually he, he drops him the first time in the first round with a good straight left hand. And I mean, Jason Kanoe hasn't been dropped since 2009, and you know, let alone he haven't been knocked out. But um, I mean, he didn't really just—I mean, he didn't break break uh, Jason Kanoe down. It wasn't like no technical fight or anything like that. It was basically—I mean, it was just like they came in there and. They might have felt each other out for about a good 20 seconds, and they just started dropping bombs. Well, really, Lewis Neri started dropping bombs, put Kanoe in the, in the, in the position where he had to uh, defend himself, and the trades didn't go so well. You know, uh, Lewis, Lewis Neri got the best of the exchanges, and... Uh, did what he had to do for uh, against Jason Kanoi, but the thing about Lewis Neri, man, is his defense is is horrible, man. I mean, defense horrible, uh, sloppy technique. I mean, his his technique is so sloppy to me and kind of poor. You know, he was getting hit with a lot of uh, straight right hands. You know, he he still can't get away from those straight right hands, so. Definitely need to pick up his defense a whole lot. Um, and the whole ironic thing was, you know, he would have been in a good candidate for the World Boxing Super Series if he wouldn't have got caught with a banned substance. But, hey, sorry in motion now. Sorry to done deal. But um, it would have been interesting to see, you know, Lewis Neary hop in there and mix it up with the rest of those bantamweight guys. You know what I mean? But, um... Like I said, definitely got to work on the defense, though, uh, and all that wild, you know, sloppy uh, punching he's doing. But um, Lewis, I mean, Jason Kanoe, he was, you know, he's slow. You can see his punches come from a mile away. And uh, I guess he, you know, he just didn't have a pop just to keep uh, Neary up off of him, man. And Leary just kept pressing forward until he got him up out of there. You know, uh, dropped him twice, and the thing is, is that the ref, I, I believe that the ref stopped the fight. To me, kind of prematurely. You know, they fight over there in Tijuana, Mexico. The ref stopped the fight kind of prematurely, even though uh, Kanoe was on the ropes, but the uh, he was throwing punches back. He was fighting back. Uh, I don't think they should have stopped it yet. You know, when they stopped it, but hey, safety first, and. Uh, it is what it is, though, and Lewis Neary gets the uh, decision, and he moves on and he gets back in the, uh, you know, in the contention. So, y'all let me know what y'all think. This your boy, JB Trap House Boxing. Would you want to subscribe to the channel? Like, share the video always.